so we are going to cook one of my favourite recipes from my new book today, which is so exciting. And it's in the sweets chapter, and it's this chocolate peanut butter pie, and it's just so good. Um, dangerously good, it's so yum, so I'm going to show you how to make it. So it's got three layers to it, um, a crumbly OT base, a layer of peanut butter, and then a chocolatey layer with peanut butter and honey and vanilla, and it's just so good. And we start by just making the chocolate layer. Love the smell of cacao powder. We want loads of chocolate. Yum. Coconut oil, peanut butter. Always be generous with your peanut butter. And then some honey. You could use maple syrup, though, if you prefer. A bit of coconut sugar. A little bit of vanilla powder, which gives it such a nice flavor. And then actually just a pinch of salt, just to bring things out. There we go, so we just want to melt that together. Okay, so now you should have this, it should be thickening up, and you should have this thick, amazing chocolate layer. You can probably see it. It's just going to be so good. So we're going to leave that to cool for one side. I'm going to quickly make the base. So we just want to put in the oats, a little more peanut butter, a little bit of honey, and a tiny bit more vanilla. Just brings out the vanilla flavour in the top then. Put the lid on. Perfect, so you want to be nice and crumbly like that. And then either line a cake tin um, with some parchment paper, baking paper, or a bit of coconut oil. Put the mix in. And just use your hands to just push it down so that it really sticks together. We just want to put this in the freezer for 10 minutes or so just to get a bit firmer. So once it's set a little bit, then we want to add our peanut butter. The runnier the peanut butter, the easier this bit is. Oh yeah, this is so good. So just spread it out. How good does that look? So we're going to put that back in the freezer again for like 10 minutes or so, so that's set so that we can pour the chocolate over the top and they will keep their separate layers because that's what makes it look very good when you serve it. So now we can add our chocolate. Ready for it. Okay, that's the best bit. How good does that look? And it's so shiny and delicious. Peanuts, just for a little crunch, and looks good. These are roasted ones, they're pre-roasted, which I think is nice, because it adds a good little texture and flavor in here. It's a very indulgent, very delicious dessert. So now you just need to put it back in the freezer for a little bit longer to set, and please be patient on this, because otherwise, it will just all smush everywhere. So, oh my God. It smells like the chocolate ears, like peanut ears. If, if you like like peanut butter cups and things, this is just your guy, you've got to make him. Ta-da! So you can see how good he looks. And now's the moment we're gonna cut in. So, look at that. So good. 